Good morning, beloved of God. Hope that you are well today. December 21st, Tuesday, um, what is oftentimes uh, called the longest night uh, as winter begins, actually at 8.59, I was reading the paper, a.m., winter began at 8.59 a.m., so welcome to winter. Benny, can you say welcome to winter? Welcome to winter. Welcome to winter. Um, and uh, if uh, there will be opportunity, um, various places to, to worship this evening uh, at a service for the longest night, those that are, uh, find themselves in, in, in grief uh, and loneliness. Um, actually, uh, again, the, 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 the technical longest night, you, we've already done, that was last night. So here we are, the dawn of a new day. Uh, remembering God's mercy that uh, brings light into the darkness of our journey and of our lives. Um, December 21st, Christ in our home invites us to a devotion uh, in the book of Psalms. And so we have Psalm Tuesday here, this week of Christmas, 113. Hey, Bennett Peter, I'm going to ask you to stop bumping the tripod. Every time your feet touch that, it sh it shakes this. So can you please move over, sweetie? Psalm 113, if you'd like to, to join along, reading and hearing God's word this morning for you. Be invited to read along or listen in devotion and let God's word wash over you on this Psalms Tuesday. Praise the Lord, praise, O servants of the Lord, praise the name of the Lord. Blessed be the name of the Lord from this time on and forevermore. From the rising of the sun to its setting, the name of the Lord is to be praised. The Lord is high above all nations and his glory above the heavens. Who is like, sorry, earthquakes as we read today. Who is like the Lord our God, who is seated on high, who looks down, who looks far down on the heavens and on the earth? He, ri he raises the poor from the dust and lifts the needy from the ash heap to make them sit with princes, with the princes of his people. He gives the barren woman a home, making her the joyous mother of children. Praise the Lord. Feeling Grateful is the title of our devotion from Christ in our home, if you would like to read along. It invites our focus to the second verse that we encountered. Blessed be the name of the Lord for from this time on and forevermore. Let's encounter our devotion together. Today's psalm makes me think of a Bible camp song that goes like this. Blessed be the Lord, the Lord, the God of Israel, from everlasting to everlasting. Praise the Lord, give thanks to the Lord, our God is good. His steadfast love endures forever, for God is good. He will tell of the mighty deeds of the Lord and show for all God's people. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel, from everlasting to everlasting, I think is probably the one. We sang this song often at Camp, at camp of the Cross near Garrison, North Dakota. It became for me a beautiful reminder to praise the Lord and give thanks for all that God has done. I am writing at the close of 2020, a year that has shown us how worthy God is to be praised. <coughs> Through the tears and love of friends and strangers, God has, kept, God has wept with us in our losses. God's presence has been made known in the form of healthcare workers, caring neighbors, community food pantries, and more. Through digital worship or drive-up communion, we have been reminded of God's goodness and God's steadfast love. Join me in prayer this morning, won't you? Blessed be the name of the Lord who provides all we need. Blessed be the one whose name is worthy to be praised. Amen. And as this day unfolds before you, be invited to pray. Uh, and as you do, be, be invited to pray for food pantries. For our friends friends at the Rio Grande um, Food Project, um, as they receive um, all of your gifts of food from this past month uh, and, and on our journey together and distribute to those in need uh, throughout each week. May God bless you and hold you this day. 
as we continue to um, find room to uh, be still, to prepare, to care for one another, uh, as we uh, head towards the great story of Christmas on Friday and Saturday this week. Hey, Addy, are you coming or not? Okay, Addy has a joke, and I've been waiting for her. Um, so, if you'd like, hold on for a second. Come on. God bless you, beloved. What do you call a sleeping dinosaur? Nice and loud. What do you call a sleeping dinosaur? What do you call a sleeping dinosaur? What? Dinosaur. Dinosaur. <laughs> well, let that carry you today. God bless you, friends.